Hey my beauties, I am back with another Wednesday review video. This time is on my Urban Decay eyeliners that you guys see me use pretty much all the time. Um, I actually have four of them, but for the life of me I cannot find the perversion shade of eyeliner. So I just have my Smoke, which is this one. It is a very... It's kind of like a light black, almost gray color. Uh, I have Sabbath, which is a almost like a midnight blue, very dark blue. And then I have black velvet, and this is just a black. This is it's pretty much all it is. It's just a black. And then I have Perversion, which is actually a darker shade black than the black velvet is. Um, I will have swatches uh, and everything Want in my Tumblr, on my Tumblr account, I'll post a picture of the swatches and I'll also have them in the beginning of this video. You will had already seen them by the time this starts. So um, I love these eyeliners. I use them, you guys see me use them in every single uh, makeup tutorial that I use, that I have, and yeah, I, I love these, these eyeliners. They're creamy. They're, they go on very well. They um, they stay on. They stay on your waterline. They're almost waterproof. They don't say waterproof on them, but they act as if they are waterproof. So that's what I love about this. I have not been able to find a eyeliner that has stayed on my waterline and not smudged or smeared or you know fallen out looks like I've been crying all day I have not been able to find an eyeliner that stays and just doesn't smudge and these eyeliners don't do that they don't smudge, they don't smear they don't come off unless you use a makeup wipe um, I've had, I've done a few swatches when I first bought them and I literally, I had to use a makeup wipe, makeup remover um, liquid to get them off. I couldn't even do it with soap and water. It was, it just, they didn't, they wouldn't come off. So that's actually a really good thing. And they are $20 for a full size, one full size pencil is $20. I got these particular three um, at Ulta for $20. I got all three of them for $20. And I think, yeah. They are actually this size. I don't use the smoke very often, so it still kind of is the full size that I got it when I originally got it. So they do come in this size. I obviously use black velvet a lot more than any of the other other four, actually. As you can tell, yeah. I use the black velvet quite often. And also the perversion. I love perversion. It's very it's very pigmented black, and I like that when I'm doing a dark, smoky look, or just a dark look in general. Um, but yeah, they were they came in a travel size pack at my Ulta store for twenty dollars, and I thought that was a very good deal to get three travel size ones rather than the full size eyeliner, which alone will cost twenty dollars at my at my Ulta at least. You might find them cheaper somewhere else, but at my store they were twenty dollars for a full size. So yeah, they are very pigmented. They they are very pigmented. I have actually black velvet on my waterline right now, and it it just it glides on so smoothly, and you don't have to keep going and keep going to get the color to come on the waterline. It's just automatically there. It is automatically pig pig ugh, pigmented, sorry, and yeah, they're just a very good eyeliner. So I recommend these to anyone who wants an eyeliner that doesn't smudge and that is a very good color payoff for a reasonable price if you can find the three pack. If you can't find the three pack, then if you have the money, I still would say it's worth it, worth the $20 to get an eyeliner like this. So that is pretty much all I have to say about these eyeliners. I will have the link below if I can find the three pack on Alto's website that I bought them on. Um, well, actually, I bought them in the store, 
But if I can find the three pack on their website, I will link it below. What or not, I will. If not, I will find the link to this the full size eyeliner, and I will post it in the description box down there. And I will also have a link to my Twitter and my Facebook, and you can go follow me and like me on those. I'll have a link below to my Tumblr where I'll have the swatches and my other links to my other videos on my Tumblr. I just started the Tumblr, so I don't have a lot on there, but um, I will have the swatches to all three of these eyeliners. Um, for those of you who are wondering what I have on my nails, I have the Rimmel 60 second, uh, Rimmel London 60 second uh, nail polishes in 210 Mintalicious and 231 Blue Eyed Girl. I These are really good items. Uh, nail polishes. So I just thought I'd do something simple and fun on my nails. Um, I have this makeup look. If you guys want to see a tutorial on it, then leave in the comments below and I will do a tutorial on this look. I actually have an upcoming review on the palette that I used for this look up here. It'll be up here soon after, after this one. It'll be up and then my earrings I got at Walmart for the pack of like three of them for like five bucks. So yeah, and then my shirt is from Maurice's. So just in case anybody was wondering and nobody would ask or anything. So um, that is it. And just, oh, remember to subscribe. That would be awesome. It's that little red button right there. And to a thumbs this video up for more uh, videos and to share and comment below on anything you want to see next and I will see you in the next video. Remember that you are beautiful the way you are and that I love you. Bye guys.